and our quest for fulfillment, we often find ourselves caught in the relentless pursuit of external success, chasing after wealth, possessions, and status. Yet, there exists a lesser-known path, a way of being that flows in harmony with the very rhythm of life itself. This is the realm of effortless abundance, a state of grace where one's actions align seamlessly with the cosmic dance, leading to a profound and lasting prosperity. To participate in this practice, often referred to as Zen, is to touch the eternal facet of our being. It is the realization that we are not merely creatures of time, but also of an ageless essence that transcends the constraints of the physical world. This self-awareness allows us to function with the greatest efficacy, unbound by the linear progression of events, and instead flowing with the timeless pulse that animates all of existence. In the wisdom of surrender, we discover that sometimes the most potent action is that of non-action. This is not the passivity of inertia, but the deliberate choice to step back and allow the currents of life to move freely. It is in this space of surrender that we find the freedom to receive the fullness of experience, unburdened by the need to possess or control. The traditional path to prosperity is often seen as one of unrelenting effort, where we must work tirelessly to acquire and amass as much as possible. Yet there is another way, a route that is less obvious and more subtle, one that flows against the grain of constant striving. This is a way of life marked by a profound sense of calm and abundance, where one's actions are never motivated by fear or scarcity. In this state of effortlessness, we act not because we seek external rewards, but because it is the natural expression of our true nature. The impetus for our actions arises from an alignment with the deepest aspects of ourselves, rather than from the pursuit of material gain. It is akin to the tree that does not strain to grow, but thrives effortlessly, nurtured by the harmonious conditions of its environment. This effortless approach is not about inactivity or passivity. Rather, it is about finding the most natural and effective form of action that resonates with the rhythms of life. When we embrace this state of being, our actions become unforced and, as a result, imbued with a higher efficacy. It is a dance with the universe, where we move in sync with the currents of existence rather than attempting to command them. Cultivating this effortless abundance also implies a deep trust in the inherent generosity of the cosmos. It is the recognition that there is enough, that our needs will be met without the constant struggle against scarcity. By aligning ourselves with the natural order and contributing our unique gifts, we become conduits for the ever-flowing abundance of the universe. This shift in perspective goes beyond the mere accumulation of material wealth. It is a transformation in our very way of being. Abundance becomes synonymous with a richness of experience, a wealth of inner peace, and a profound appreciation for the simple yet profound moments that make up the tapestry of our lives. This elevation of consciousness allows us to view the landscape of existence with a clarity that transcends the limited confines of the ego. The path of effortless abundance is not a linear progression, but a journey imbued with sincerity, where each step reflects our deepest truths. Every action we take aligns harmoniously with the cosmos and every moment becomes an opportunity to manifest the profound inner fulfillment that resides within. The doors to genuine prosperity are unlocked, not through the pursuit of external validation, but through the cultivation of a profound, of a profound understanding of our place in the grand scheme of existence. At the heart of this journey lies the mastery of detachment, 
a profound knowledge of our role within the intricate web of life. Detachment is not the absence of emotion or willpower, but the wisdom to approach these forces with a clear and balanced perspective. It is the ability to navigate the external world while maintaining an unwavering equilibrium within. In this state of detachment, we recognize the transient nature of all things. Success and failure, pleasure and pain, gain and loss. These are but fleeting states, each giving way to the other in due time. By observing these fluctuations without becoming entangled in them, we cultivate a resilience that allows us to engage passionately with our goals while remaining prepared for any outcome. This concept of detachment extends beyond the realm of emotions and circumstances. It also encompasses our relationship with time itself. The past and the future are seen as mental constructs, useful for learning and planning, but not for residing in. The detached mind abides in the present moment, where life truly unfolds, finding freedom in the here and now, unbound by the echoes of the past or the whispers of the future. Detachment is also intimately connected to the realization of our own agency and the liberation that comes with it. While we may not be able to control all external events, we possess a vast territory of internal choice, the power to shape our attitudes, responses, and values, and to forge our internal world, regardless of the storms raging outside. The mastery of detachment, then, is a quiet revolution against the tumult of external demands and expectations. It is a reclamation of personal space, a sanctuary where we can breathe freely and move with grace, unencumbered by the weight of societal conditioning and the need for constant validation. Transcending the illusion of control is the next step in this transformative journey. It begins with the recognition that our grasp over the unfolding of life is limited. This understanding is not a surrender to powerlessness, but an awakening to a different kind of influence, one that is cultivated from within and projected gently upon the external world. When we transcend the illusion of control, we cease to identify solely as the doer, the one who must make all things happen. Instead, we see ourselves as participants in a grander scheme, contributors to a vast interconnected tapestry where our actions are but threads woven amongst countless others. This perspective ushers us into the realm of humility, where we can acknowledge our limitations without compromising our sense of self-worth. The beauty of transcending the illusion of control lies in the peace it brings. Without the constant strain of trying to enforce our will on every aspect of life, we can engage more fully with the present moment. Our energy is no longer dissipated in battles we cannot win, but is channeled into creative and adaptive responses to the world, as it is, not as we insist it must be. This transition from a worldview characterized by the exercise of power to one that emphasizes cooperation and harmonious interaction represents a progression towards a heightened state of consciousness. Within this realm, we navigate various circumstances, occasionally exerting control, frequently acquiring knowledge, and consistently finding ourselves interconnected with a wider collective. It is within this space of engaging with the unpredictable and embracing the uncontrolled that we discover genuine agency and the tranquil efficacy of a life aligned with the cosmic order. By synchronizing our movements with the rhythms of the universe, we become one with the cosmic dance, where everything, from the subatomic to the galactic, participates. To align with these rhythms is to listen deeply and respond to the subtle cues and patterns that govern the natural flow of life. It is to observe the effortless changing of the seasons, the precision of the tides, 
and the unfolding of life cycles, both with and without human intervention. In this observation, we gain the wisdom to act, not just with the mind, but with an intuitive attunement that senses the right moment to act or refrain. This alignment is not about imposing our will upon the world, but about finding our own beat within the larger melody, adding our unique voice to the grand chorus in a way that is harmonious with the whole. It is to recognize the ebb and flow of opportunity and challenge, the times to advance and the times to yield, the moments to exert energy and the moments to conserve it. Embracing change as an inherent quality of existence is a hallmark of this alignment. The universe is in a constant state of flux, and to resist this change is to resist the very nature of reality. By accepting change as a given, we navigate life with greater ease, adapting to new circumstances as they arise and finding opportunities for growth and development. To be aligned with the rhythms of the universe is also to realize that we are part of a larger whole, a thread in the intricate tapestry of life. This realization brings a sense of responsibility and a desire to act in ways that benefit not only ourselves, but the greater good. Our decisions and actions ripple outwards, affecting the delicate web that sustains us all. Ultimately, aligning with the rhythms of the universe is to step into a flow state where action becomes almost effortless, where we are no longer swimming against the current, but being carried by it. It is a state of grace that arises not from the struggle to control, but from the deep connection to the inherent patterns and boundless complexity of existence. The wisdom of surrender is an invitation to step into a current that is larger and more powerful than the individual self. It is an acknowledgement that despite our best efforts, there are forces at play that transcend our direct influence. Surrender is not about giving up, but about giving over to a process, trusting in the unfolding of events and the inherent goodness that can emerge when we let go of our rigid attempts to steer the river of life. The knowledge of surrender frees us from our obsession with maintaining control over our lives. It is the realization that life, at its core, is a self-organizing system capable of generating order and beauty without the imposition of human will. By releasing control and allowing the creative energy of the universe to flow through us, we transform into active participants in the evolutionary dance of existence. Surrender is an act of profound courage, requiring the strength to recognize the limits of our own power and the humility to admit that we do not have all the answers. It is a conscious choice to open ourselves to the possibility that there might be a grander design, a flow and pattern that transcends our individual orchestrations. This surrender brings a sense of calm, not the stillness of indifference, but the poise of a tree whose roots are secure and whose branches are pliable enough to weather any storm. It is an active participation in life that acknowledges the dynamic relationship between our individual choices and the broader forces that shape our experience. In the space of surrender, we allow ourselves to be surprised by life, opening to opportunities and solutions that we could not have planned for or imagined. We become receptive to the unexpected help and serendipitous encounters that can steer us in new transformative directions and to the wisdom that often arises only when we let go of our preconceptions. Ultimately, Achieving success in life requires not dogged effort, but an elegant dance with the deeper currents of existence, a delicate balance of active and passive participation, where we discover that true wealth lies not in the accumulation of possessions, but in the profound awareness of our place 
within the infinite fabric of creation.